Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. In this tutorial, we'll cover some advanced features of GitHub and Jenkins integration, specifically focusing on continuous integration slash continuous deployment, CI slash CD, practices. This is part 8 of our series, so we will build on previous concepts. Hashtag 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 part 8, advanced Jenkins and GitHub integration. Hashtag 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 objective. 1. Set up a Jenkins pipeline that integrates with GitHub. 2. Use webhooks for automatic builds on code push. 3. Implement testing and deployment stages in the pipeline. Hashtag 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 prerequisites. Jenkins installed and running. A GitHub repository to work with. Basic knowledge of Jenkins and GitHub. Access to Jenkins and GitHub. Hashtag 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 step 1, setting up webhooks in GitHub. 1. Go to your GitHub repository. 2. Click on settings webhooks add webhook. 3. In the payload URL field, enter your Jenkins server URL followed by slash GitHub webhook slash. For example, http slash slash your Jenkins URL slash GitHub webhook slash. 4. Change the content type to application slash JSON. 5. Select the just the push event option. 6. Click add webhook. Hashtag 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 step 2, Jenkins configuration. 1. Install GitHub plugin. Go to Jenkins dashboard manage Jenkins manage plugins. Search for GitHub and install the GitHub integration plugin. 2. Configure Jenkins. Go to Manage Jenkins Configure System. Add your GitHub server details under GitHub section. Add your GitHub credentials. Hashtag 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 step 3, creating a Jenkins pipeline. 1. Create a new pipeline job. Click on New Item. Enter your job name and select Pipeline. 2. Configure the pipeline. In the Pipeline section, you can either define your pipeline script directly or point it to a Jenkins file in your repository. Here's an example of a simple Jenkins file that includes build, test, and deploy stages. Groovy. Pipeline. Agent any. Stages. Stage. Build. Steps. Echo building. Slash slash example. Compile your code or build your application. SH echo building the application. Stage, test. Steps. Echo testing. Slash slash example, run your tests here. SH echo running tests. Slash slash you can execute your test commands here. Stage, deploy. Steps. Echo deploying. Slash slash example, deploy your application. SH echo deploying the application. Post. Success. Echo pipeline completed successfully. Failure. Echo pipeline failed. Hashtag 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 step 4, triggering the pipeline. With the webhook configured, every time you push changes to your GitHub repository, the webhook will notify Jenkins to start the pipeline. Hashtag 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 step 5, testing the setup. 1. Make a change to your code in the GitHub repository, example update a readme file or a source file. 2. Push the changes to GitHub. 3. Go to Jenkins and check if the pipeline was triggered automatically. 4. Review the console output to see if all stages executed successfully. Hashtag 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 step 6, advanced configurations. Parallel stages, you can run tests in parallel to speed up your pipeline. Groovy. Stage, test. Parallel. Stage, unit tests. Steps. SH echo running unit tests. 
Stage, Integration Tests Steps SH Echo Running Integration Tests Environment Variables, Use Environment Variables to Manage Configurations Groovy Environment App underscore name equals my app Hashtag 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 conclusion In this tutorial, we set up a basic Jenkins pipeline that integrates with GitHub using webhooks. We created a simple Jenkins file that contains build, test, and deploy stages. This foundational setup allows for continuous integration and deployment for your projects. In future parts, we can explore more advanced topics like using Docker with Jenkins, managing secrets, and more complex deployment strategies. Feel free to ask if you have any questions or need further assistance.